holiday season gentlemen my husband right now is preparing some delicious green apples how you doing youtube got in great show here doing a little check in before play some video games cutting some apples getting it into my jar One of the special ways of making the lime is through apples. So a little trick to them. Should I be teaching them this? No. You're mm. getting a little older, a little wet behind the ears, a little better. Somebody will teach you this. But right now, all you see. It's cut apples. <laughs> okay? So you see the beginning and you see the end. So. You don't see the in between. <laughs> <laughs> see how hard it takes me to make my family happy and myself. You know, occasion, celebration. You know what I mean? It's always good to put your hands in it and make something. Homemade. Me and my love, me and my lovely here, we love homemade stuff. We do a lot of things homemade. Babe, why are you doing that with the camera? Don't worry, they hear us. It's plugged in. That has a range. That uh microphone has a range of fifty feet. Oh my bad. <laughs> yeah, I looked it up when we were in the internet. I looked it up. My bad, my bad, my bad. So you gotta, you see, family. You gotta cut up each and every apple. Get a little preview of what I'm doing. Apples. The apples. You gotta cut the apple. Three times. Three three squares. Like that. For, for a snack later. Yeah, this is for a snack later. You know what I mean? Right at PG. We want it right now. Look. Just kept it PG. YouTube. Can't say it will be always like that. He's just a man cutting his apple. <laughs> Ain't nothing wrong with that. Cutting some apples, right? <laughs> the country life has upon me. It's a beautiful life. Oh, snap. Runaway apple. <laughs> Oh man, I did a whole bag, as you can see. It's like a, what a pounder. How would these things go for? Three, almost three pounds? For five pounds. Five pounds. Apple. Here's some of it. The last two. I've been sitting here straight. One thing, uh, I went to a program once when I was a kid. They teach you how to cut things like apples. Peel potatoes. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> they make you peel potatoes, man. Screwed up. <laughs> you act up, and you ask somebody for help, they tell you, peel some potatoes. <sighs> I'm playing. I'm glad, you know what? I don't know. I don't know if you guys talk about what I want to do. <laughs> yeah, I have it. I have it here right now. You guys, you see, can you see it, babe? Apple? Yeah. I have it here first because I have to wash them before I put them in there. Even though they're brand new, it don't matter. They still got to sit on the ground somewhere on a field in somebody's pocket. So for now, let's go in well, my, my lovely over here. She don't care. She be eating the apples like like a rabbit. <laughs> I like apples. Nah, it's good for you apples. A lot, a lot of vitamin C. Mm -hmm. It's good for my fingers. See, I'm doing it for my fingers. <laughs> That's why I got those strong fingers. What you do for those strong fingers? Cut some apples. <laughs> Get the vitamin C. 
<laughs> oh yeah. You know what I realized to do too? What I did? I needed a shovel, right? So I found the best shovel I could find, but I didn't see the name of it, and I think I'm pretty honored about the kind of, you know, and the, the, honored because the lady's a, she is a legend, kind of, right? Yeah. So I go out to get a shovel. I look on Amazon for a shovel. Now, I didn't want, a, like, a big giant shovel. I wanted a garden shovel, you know what I'm saying? Something in between big and small, a medium shovel, you know? So I looked at, I like the, uh, the army shovels. You know, the, what do they call that? The ones, that, the ones that fold. Oh, uh, survival shovels. Yeah, that, but no, it's called something else. Anyway, so I saw a bunch of those, and I was like, ooh, those are interesting. I would like that, you know? So I was like, nah, but I need something, like, you know, for the garden and stuff. So, there you go. Take this shovel. I found the perfect shovel. Send it to my house. As it's on the way here, I realized, honestly, I bought a Martha Stewart shovel. Shovel I bought. Matter of fact, yes. I'll show you my cute little shovel. I'll be right back. I'm gonna stun more. I'm not believing unless it's in my hands. You know how I'm big it is. I'm gonna stun more. Look at my shovel I bought. Isn't that awesome? Little shovel. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that cool? That's just awesome. So when I do my garden, as you can see in the background, got a little garden going on. You know, I got I'm building a fence around my property. I have a little more privacy than my honey sitting out there. Not a lot of kids around the neighborhood, you know, like bad people. See? Starting to come out. Nothing wrong nothing wrong with that, right? Nope. Cutting some apples. Mm hmm. I mean, the, the apple tree out there, the, the tree right here is an apple tree that we have sitting right there. And I have one outside also. So I don't have to buy the apple, you know? <laughs> Grow them. One day I'll grow some peppers. <laughs> I tried to grow some peppers, but I wasn't successful. We had a cucumber plant growing from last year that we forgot about. Last year we got about like 10 harvests out of a cucumber. Mm -hmm. This harvest was going to be 20, but then we had some evil god uh, landscaping company, you know, for my landlord. Some evil dude came and killed my freaking cucumber plant. And you wonder why I'm building a gate? My property. Oh, I'm heavily. <laughs> that city's such a. <sighs> I don't know. That's work, guys. Cutting apples. My wife thought it would be nice to show you guys me cutting apples. I think it's interesting, you know? It's well. Interesting. Tonight game is gonna be a little different. Oh yeah, we're gonna. Dad, you can talk to me. Oh no, I'm just excited. Let me explain that. We're getting a new Tomb Raider game. Oh yeah. Can't wait. Can't wait. Found a different story, guys. A different story of the Tomb Raider. We haven't. Me and my wife haven't really explored the Tomb Raider games. We just started doing that, and it's like a very eventful. We we what was the what was the uh, Tomb Raider we got? Um the. The uh, 20th anniversary. Yeah, we got the 20th anniversary, and we beat that to story mode. Yeah. Which was phenomenal. <laughs> it was free on PlayStation Plus. They gave us the game free. The adventures in there, man. I might just play it again. Well, I beat the Yaba Ab what that uh witch one. I beat oh, it. Oh, you beat the witch? I didn't beat the witch yet. That's the only thing I didn't beat. Oh my God, you're gonna. You're gonna you're gonna bug you're gonna out. Cry, right? <laughs> you're gonna you're gonna bug out. I saw you playing and it was like what the hell all the stuff was moving around and stuff. It's a time consuming. It's like all right, you get to one spot and then you have to time the rope and everything because the rope pulls her in and then you got to smack it before she pulls away. And every time she pulls away, she resets the um 
her her little minions. But come to find out, it's the poison gas, the poison plant she's using, and the people that Laura Croft is really killing are actual people of the of the of the colony. Or yeah, well, no, because that witch went after the colony, and and some lady asked you to go find her father, right? Do you eventually find the the grandfather? Yeah, but you know what? The what? witch is not really a, the witch. The witch is really the grandmother. Really? Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. What a surprise. That's what I found out. And the tro- and the so that's why the grandfather went after it, because he was looking for his wife. Yeah. Oh, that's hot. And then the crazy thing is, is like I got a couple of ultra rare trophies that no one's ever got. So for me to get those. They're so pretty, right? It does look pretty. So, okay, what you said? so for me to get those ultra trophies, I was like, oh shit. And I had to research how to beat it first. And I'm one that will try it, but if I get stumped and have to run away from a game, it means I'm going to watch a walkthrough or read about the damn game. And that's what I did. It's time consuming. It's worse than the other one you helped me through. You know the one in the observatory room? Which one? In Tomb Raider, when you when you find out who the who the main character is. Oh, Pick up a new seed and maybe get a green apple plant. Ooh la la, mustache. 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 Hi. <laughs> hello. 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 I'm just a busy bee. I know. I'm having fun watching you. And ladies and gentlemen, there's a storm brewing outside. You can't really tell because it's too bright. But from my end, the sky is gray. I'm going to just pour it in. Yeah. Because I won't make a mess. So easily. <laughs> did you get that on camera? Yes, I did. I made a mess. I said slowly. Yeah, right. I should have went the other way. Let everybody see the mess. <laughs> oh, wait, I did that wrong on camera, at least. Actually, no, I caught it all. <laughs> I got it a little bit. I caught it all. <laughs> Put a bottle of water and make up for that, right? <laughs> <laughs> now you gotta have your liquids now. <laughs> It looks good. Look, the one got stuck there. I hate when that happens. Oh. Oh, now I got two there. No. Get out of here. I got it out. Come on. Get on your hands. Apple juice. Now you leave it alone for a couple of days. You got apple juice. You understand? Now she's just to walk away from you. Say Keep goodbye. Back. Huh? Say goodbye. Goodbye. How long has it been? I don't know, 14 minutes. Nice. Well, everybody, God bless everybody. Have a great day. Try to enjoy the little things in life. You'll see you'll be a happier person. <laughs>